Good afternoon everyone, hope you all are doing well. In this video is going to be a very short one. It's something that I came across a while back and I haven't done a video on it. It's how to get anyone's profile from LinkedIn and turn it into a CV. A lot of people will know about this, but a fair few people that I've shown in the past have been very surprised, even experienced recruiters. So what the premise of it is, is we're going to basically get someone's profile and turn it into a CV with one click. So it's very easy to do, anyone can do it it's free etc so the premise of it is is looking at someone's profile so let, let's take an example this gentleman I don't know what he does who he is whatever but we're gonna make this into a CV so all you do is click more save as PDF and then it will just download instantly and then we've got a gentleman CV here it doesn't have any contact details on it in terms of it's got his you know social chain whatever um, but it hasn't got his personal details which is fine which is exactly what we want from clients or when we send it to clients we don't want their personal detail on it so let's take examples of someone else again if we want to download the CV we click more and I'm going to tell you how to turn it into a word document shortly so we've got another one again same thing we've got a CV and um, from there it's got his awards etc so why you would use this is a lot of senior people like this gentleman, I'm guessing probably doesn't have a CV. If he does, it's very out of date. A lot of developers don't actually have a CV as well. So a lot of experienced people or people that won't find it hard to get a new position will not have a CV. And let's say we had a chat with Oliver and he said to me, look, um, I'm looking for you to um, find him a new position. Yeah, you're not gonna ask him can you send me your CV? You can say, look, I'll contact some companies. Would you be happy for me to share a bit about you? Yeah, or your profile. You can do that very easily. You just click more, download the CV as a PDF and it's done. Now what you might wanna do is you might wanna go to a website called PDF to doc and you might just wanna drag and drop it here. What this would do, it converts it to a PDF and you can just download it and it turns it into a Word document. So you might wanna just tidy it up, make it look a little better so you might want to just take out the contact section there um, just to make it, oh, I've deleted the whole thing. But you know what, you, you'll obviously do do what you have to do, top skills, etc. And that looks not too bad. Obviously, you can add to it, you can change it, etc. Um, you might just want to take out that. And that's, that's fine to actually send to a client. Chances are that they may be able to work it out who it is or just google that section and his profile will come up so only send this with the permission from the candidate to do so and also you want to send it to clients where you have terms of business in place so if they do go to him directly they'll still be eligible for the fee they would still potentially be eligible for the fee even if you don't have terms signed but you need agreement in place um, with that so if you are you know interested in doing this method it's very simple anyone can do it with a linkedin profile and you literally just go onto someone's profile and it pretty much works it's unlimited you can just save again um and then for example this person so in in a sense you can gather a lot of profiles off of this cv wise and you can also use it to speed up the whole recruitment process which is the biggest thing so if you speak to someone, let's take Dominic again, for example, we spoke to Dominic. He said, yeah, you know what? I'm happy for you to look. Don't beg him for a CV. If he says, I haven't got a CV, you might have to wait a few days for him to make it. You might even spend the time making it for him, but at least you can just quickly download it off of that. So I hope this video helped. Short one, but I thought it would be very worth sharing. Take care.